Okay, so in this episode, we are going to see how we can download the SAS in our Windows machine. So here is the website of SAS that is SAS-lang.com. So you have to go to install and after that you will go here and for Windows there is no Ruby, Ruby pre-installed. So what you have to do, you have to install the Ruby first on your Windows machine. So let's start this. So I will download this. Any package is good for me. So I will just download it. So now you can see it's just completing setup. So I will open this setup here. Okay, so you can see it's now asking to run. So run this file and let's see what's going on. Yes, accept the license and install everything. So it's installing Ruby. Okay, so now after this, you have to check. So open command prompt and you have to say like gem dash v and it says command not found let's restart command prompt okay so type gem and and yes it's having something that means if i type gem space dash v you can see i have my ruby correctly installed so let's check for SAS. So I will type SAS dash V. So let's, yeah. Now hit enter and you can see it says SAS not found. So just have to run this command. So gem install SAS. And it will install SAS on your machine. So it will take little time. And after that, your, so, okay. So what say allow? Okay, so it's now installing SAS on your machine and now you can see the SAS is installed in your Windows machine. So now run SAS space dash V again and you will get the version and it says 3.4.24 and it's the latest version not available inside the documentation of the SAS. So this is everything and we will meet in the next episode till then if you have any problem please feel free to comment me on facebook also and like bitfumes on facebook twitter and instagram so we will meet in the next episode till then goodbye